Hello, everybody. All right, get your eyes ready because we're playing WWE Supercar today. And look what we got here. New People's Champion Challenge is starting soon. It's Tito Santana versus Mr. Perfect Kurt Henning. And the next event starting Thursday. So, all right, we can go ahead and take a look at these stats and um, just base off that quick glance real quick. It looks like Tito Santana is already... Uh, looking to be my favorite card, 934, 889, 811, 799, 8, for Kurt Henning. Um, I'm, I, I'm guessing that people, they don't, um, they don't know too much about Tito Santana. So my guess is already going to be Mr. Perfect Kurt Henning is going to win this event. Uh, wait for it to cycle around again he is a down yellow arrow Tito Santana is a left blue arrow so um I'm not really sure Tito Santana's stats look better than Kurt Hennings at least in charisma not so much power I mean it's not a huge difference but I honestly want I want Tito Santana but I'm guessing Mr. Perfect himself is gonna win uh, I am going to participate in this event, hopefully to get, if not get, uh, the Tito Santana or Curry Henning card to get another survivor card because I desperately need it for the road to glory. Once again, I have yet to pull my second survivor card. So let me go ahead and check my King of the Ring. Let's see what's going on. Um, they're going to need refilled here or actually... Yeah, they, they need to be refilled now. I just beat D'Lo. I'm pretty sure D'Lo was in my last King of the Ring. So let me go ahead and uh, refill them real quick. Switch Triple H for The Rock. Refill Shawn Michaels. Refill my Stings. Put in Natalia because even though she is not pro and I haven't leveled her up at all, um, I might still get lucky if somebody running a three-man ban and... They'll put out a common diva or whatever, and uh, Natalia will just demolish, you know, common. So let me take a look at how I won this one. Uh, DX beat Edge and Hogan. Sting beat Sean. Sting beat Hogan. All right. Um, a lot of people complain about the three-man ban strategy. I'm, I'm using it somewhat. I mean... Yes and no, I'm using, I'm, I mean, as you guys see, I have uh, three legendary pros, the two stings, and a legendary Natalia. That keeps me at a low tier survivor, and the rest are commons. The rest are commons simply because I don't really have any other good cards to put down there, so I should keep myself in the low tier. But, um, I, I won't be winning this simply for the fact that I'm sure Jarek and JJ666 have uh, Road to Glory cards. And just like my last King of the Ring, I came up uh, semifinals, I want to say. Or quarter quarterfinals, sorry. Quarterfinals, and I had got a legendary Eddie Guerrero from that. I was hoping for a Diva to Pro, but that didn't work out for me. So in this video, I'm just going to be doing exhibitions. Hopefully to catch on camera me pulling my second survivor card. If not, then uh, just enjoy the show, guys. And um, if you're one of the people that I played, you know, comment below and tell me how awesome of a job I did of kicking your ass on this. I'm just joking. But uh, let's see what we got. Diva, Dorian, Brie Bella. Again, I don't have a legendary pro Diva, so... I'm always going to lose on that. I'm playing with my best cards. I'm not running a three-man band strategy on exhibition. I'm not going to do that until uh, People's Champion Challenge. I'm hoping I pull my second survivor card. That way I can go down a couple tiers. That way I don't have to run into Road to Glory cards um, in the People's Champion Challenge. And, uh, you know come up good in the rankings I I don't expect to be the top 850 but I oh wow already probably should have checked that before recording but 
Oh well. Um, but I do expect to get a survivor card. So did I? There we go. Okay. All right. Let's combine the warrior, Undertaker, Triple H. But, uh, yeah, so while the People's Champion Challenge is going on, this will be my last Survivor King of the Ring I'm going to attempt. I am going to work towards getting more um, legendaries, legendary pros. So I'm going to uh, go down a rank in King of the Ring and do legendary King of the Rings. And uh, hopefully get four more. I should be able to get four more legendary. Well, yeah, four more legendaries. Uh, by the time the next Road to Glory comes around, which would be next Thursday, this Thursday is People's Champion Challenge. So my goal is to, fingers crossed, get Legendary Pro Diva, get have my uh, second exhibition uh, Survivor card pulled, and um, have a Survivor card from People's Champion Challenge by the time next road to glory comes all right i am going to go ahead and oh i, I pulled this guy uh yesterday off the exhibition that was pretty cool i mean i have no use for him but i'm gonna keep him around for a little while just for the fact that i pulled it <laughs> uh that's the eddie girl i won off my last king of the ring all right so now i am going to boost up yeah i'm gonna boost up hogan and Jack Hogan with some more steroids here. Uh, so I also pulled Cesaro. That was that's pretty cool. Let's see Robin right now. Boom, boom, boom. If they're not pro, well, I uh, just want to hurry up and make room. That way I can play for a bit here. So how are you guys doing? Uh, with WWE Supercard, are you continuing to play even though um, there's been a lot of complaints and controversy over the Road to Glory prizes and, you know, all this and that? I'm going to continue to play. I mean, it, it may have hindered the game a little bit. Uh, well, I shouldn't say a little bit, a lot. But um, it's still a fun game to play and... People, I still know people enjoy it. There's still a few that watches watch my videos. There's still people that watch Biggie Dude 33 videos. So it can't be that bad, right? For all those, I have a Lana. I'm gonna keep that Lana for um, next Road to Glory because uh, I was watching Biggie Dude 33 and he was doing an uncommon strategy with uh, with uh, rare manager cards. So I'm going to keep that Lana. Even though it's plus 8, he was using the plus 5. I have a lot of cards to go through. But it seemed to have only worked on plus 1 matches. So if I ever if I get stuck on the next Road to Glory and have to do plus 1 matches again, then I'll do that. So let's see. I got my Legendary Max Pro Cena at 35, Hogan 34, Yokozuna 31. Uh, by the time of Road to Glory Day, will be fully leveled to 45. So, I will have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 fully leveled Max Pro um, Legendaries. And, as you see, I have made it to 128 out of 155 on Legendary. Because I ended up having to do plus 1 matches. So hopefully with them being max pro, I'm gonna go. I can, yeah, I can do that now. Boom! See, there you go. Push them up there. With them being fully leveled and max pro, I should be able to, you know, clean out legendary with no problems. Uh, again, I'm also hoping to have my second pool survivor card and a survivor card from the People's Champion Challenge. So that'll push Stone Cold and Edge down. Uh, I also want another legendary pro, so that'll push them down even further. So uh, let's say 
that's the survivor win from people's champion challenge that's survivor i pull off the board if it's not a diva support card if i'm lucky um and that would be the next uh legendary max pro i'll have so four survivors legendary pro and then um I'll just have three cards to get rid of for the mill side and then the the divas. I really want to get rid of these epics. I hate having epics in a road of glory deck. I know once I get rid of them and have a full survivor legendary deck, I would be able to pass the survivor stage. So uh yeah, let's work towards go back to I got sidetracked there. <laughs> Sorry about that guys. Let's go back to working towards um getting that second survivor pool here. Solo match power. Start off with that. Uh, look at that, Eddie Guerrero. Tag team: The Rock and Shawn Michaels versus Eric Rowan and Sting. Oh man. Diva Brie Bella versus Natalia. Oh, man, last night, back to back to back to back, it was a uh, power strength and then uh, another power booster. I just kept getting boosters all last night. So I have a feeling that I got probably four or five more board clears until I get my survivor. I don't know. I've, I've been attempting this for over a month now. And I still have not got it. Oh, Brock Lesnar. Are you guys liking Brock Lesnar actually showing up on Raw recently? And uh, what do you think? What do you think uh, WWE have planned for him? You think they're going to have him drop the title before WrestleMania? You think he's going to pin Cena and then uh, Rollins is going to try and cash in and he's going to stop Rollins as well? That's what I'm hoping to happen. Or do you think that he's secretly working with Seth Rollins? I personally don't. I think Seth Rollins is working with Paul Heyman because once Brock is gone, Paul Heyman, to stay relevant, is going to need a new client. And it seems like that's what they're working towards. Diva battle. A lot of people have Natalia. They probably got... The pro just based off of uh, the last Road to Glory. Charisma. Oh, here we go, guys. Fingers crossed. Let's hope. Oh, rare briefcase, of course. So now I like to start off from the top left corner. I'm going to clear some more of this before I end this video. Because I don't want to run it too long. Alright, solo match, speed and charisma. Ah, lost it. Well, I don't know. Alright, uh, there we go. Finally beat Rey Mysterio in a speed battle, even though it was speed and charisma, but that's an achievement in itself of beating Rey Mysterio. I should have put Shawn Michaels. Ah, it wouldn't have mattered. It was against Yokozuna. Great. Uh. All right, so... Ho! Um, we got Chris here. In case you haven't, if, bleh, sorry, in case you guys haven't checked out my uh, WWE Immortals game, go ahead and check that out. I just got a uh, Lumberjack Big Show on there. After I finish up, wrap up this video, I'm going to do one on that and level up that Big Show. So, so far on there, I have a 
the gold lumberjack big show the gold uh superman john cena another speed battle and they uh and the rock the silver car or the silver superstar rock edge adam rose i'm hoping that they um that they'll add more characters to their by the time uh Oh, well, by the time, what am I talking about? I hope they add more characters, like, within a month or so, because I'm sure in about a month, I am going to get bored of playing with the same people and fighting the same people over and over and over. I wonder if they would just, like, putting their toes in the water with the short roster trying to see if it would be popular or if it'll be good so far it's doing it's doing better than i thought it would honestly i i thought it would be good but i don't know i know a lot of people are jumping ship from supercar to immortals but i jump ship back and forth i'm i'm gonna keep playing both all three actually uh, super card immortals and oh there we go energy I need needed that and um, 2k15 who should we play we're gonna play Papa Hut all right we got a solo match ah sting great ah, I still ended up winning that that is awesome. That's what I'm talking about. Good thing I gave him that boost. Did that boost help? Yes, it did. Ah, look at that. Sting versus Daniel Bryan. Oh, and then Sting shows up on Raw. How do you guys feel about that? The NWO, the APA. The New Age Outlaws. It was a freaking Legends Fest there. This past Monday Night on Raw. Tag Team Power. Boom, boom, boom. Good thing I did that. Ah, he used a booster as well. Good. Rock proc. They don't match up. Should be a good, easy win for The Rock and Shawn Michaels. Toughness battles. Oh. Damn. Damn. Always with the Natalias. Well, bleh. <laughs> That's all I can say is bleh. Oh, energy. Nice. So I got... Uh, MG saved up already for the next next refills. Uh, diva, charisma. Ah, oh, finally it's a different diva. Bree versus Bree. Tag team, toughness and speed. I'm not gonna use the booster. Yeah, I didn't need to. Toughness and speed again. Easy win. All right, guys, come on. Give me a germ roll, please. Ah, super rare edge. It's a pretty cool card, but not what I was wanting. Natalia. Alright, so I'm going to do one more battle and I'm going to go ahead and end this video because I'm not going to be able to get the survivor card on on uh, footage, it seems. Should I use a power boost? What do you guys think? Let me use a power boost. Nah, I didn't need to. It was just two singles survive. That has me a little worried because that means, oh, I thought that would have meant I was going against something tough, but it's just somebody with a bunch of um, 
Ooh, I knew it. Uh, Diva Pro. But that doesn't matter because I already sacrificed my Divas. John Cena. WWE Universe. Well, okay, guys. So, I'm going to um, attempt the uh, Survivor Pool on my own here. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, can't wait for the next uh, People's Champion Challenge. Uh, leave a comment below. Tell me what side you're going to pick. And if you even know who Tito Santana is or who Mr. Perfect Kurt Henning is, uh, leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next video and in the People's Champion Challenge this Thursday.